What up though, y'all? It's your boy Sean. And of course, it's smoking with Sean. And on today's freaking video, we got my girl Ani in the building. What's up? Yeah. And on today's video, we're gonna initiate and talk about who initiates sex in a bedroom, you know? She believed that God should. And I say why we both can't, you know? So let's do it while we roll in the Dutch, of course. And what we smoking on today is just some regular Gorilla Glue. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Look at that. Let me show y'all that. Let me show y'all that. Y'all see that though? Y'all see that though? Oh my gosh. Just look at it. God. You see that? Come on now. You see the orange hairs. You see the... Don't play. Don't play with me. And of course, we smoking on a... An uh, Irish Dutch. Don't do it. Don't do it. You know I gotta play. Y'all might, might as well sponsor me at this point. Because so many... So many Dutches. So many... Oh my, y'all might as well sponsor me at this point because I didn't, I didn't roll too many. I didn't roll too many. And what I like noticing a lot is like, I don't really, I don't really be showing y'all how I be rolling. So I'm, I should, I should, I should start showing y'all how I be rolling because a lot of people are always watching my videos and saying that they don't know how to roll. Like, but that's my, I be all the way down here and I'm showing you, you know? So what I just first do is just, I cut it. I cut a little piece in, you know, and then I start splitting it up so that way you can break it apart, as you see. All right. And if you're new to the channel, all I want to say is welcome. You know, make sure you just like, subscribe, and share to your friends because everybody can enjoy smoking with Sean. Don't hold you know, me. Don't hold me for yourself. I know you love me. Don't hold me for yourself. But <laughs> so let's get the ball rolling. So, so you feel like women initiate sex? No. Shouldn't initiate sex. I don't feel like they shouldn't, but I do feel like the guy should understand when they don't want to. Okay, say no. What do you mean? Like, how can what I? Mean, say no. How can I? So, like, let's say I, you know, foreplay. I started kissing on you, looking on your neck, trying to trying to get the game rolling, and you don't want to. Like, how, who fault is that? Like, how should I know? No, 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 no. Like, that's fine. But then again, I'm the type that don't come off like that. Like come when I want to, I tell you that I want to. But I don't like beginning a foreplay. Right. So you feel like a guy shouldn't. So you you feel like you said a guy should know when the when the girls don't want it. Like no, when they like when they do. I mean, at sometimes you. I mean, you're right. But at the end of the day, it'd be like. So I can tell you that I want it, but like when you come through the door, I'm not gonna automatically just rip, rip your clothes off. Right. Nobody said that. I mean, of course, it's always. But it's, some people like that, and they don't always. Yeah, of course. I mean, a lot of people. Yeah, of course. Like, oh shit, attack me. You know, a lot of people do like that. You're right. But at the end of the day, it's all about what you tell me. I'm not gonna know that you want some if you don't tell me, or if I'm initiating it by doing all this cutesy cutesy junk, and then you like, no, which I ain't really in the mood. All right, I'm gonna stop. What do you like? No, like I have, I have an ex. Now where you, I could let him know, you know, I want this, this, that, and the other. Mm -hmm. Like when you get here, or when you get home, or whatever. Right. But if I didn't just like up and like as soon as he walked through the door, like rip him out his clothes, nothing was gonna happen. Cause he didn't initiate it, or he always yeah. wanted you to. Or because he wanted me to. Right. Because like you just said, how, what if I, what if you don't want it? How he know that? Hmm? How he going to know if you want it or not? No, I'm it? saying like I could tell him or like I could text him or uh -huh. like if we was on the phone before he came. Uh-huh. He know what I want when he get to the house. Right. But he's just going to sit down if I don't initiate it as soon as he get through the door. Mm. Well... He probably not an aggressive guy, cause some guys are scared of a rape case. That's a lot. Even you can rape your wife. You can rape your that? wife. Even though she's your wife and she says no, 
and you you still do it, it's still rape because she said no, even if she's your wife. So some guys just get a, a rape case. That's very, very foul. On the wife's behalf. Right. What? You feel me? He probably... So, you know, he probably initiated it, got her clothes off, you know what I'm saying? And then jammed it in. But the wife said no, and she can go to the police. Like, I told you no, Jerry. Why would you do it? Jerry. <laughs> just saying, like. So, no, like, like I told you, on the 50 Shades of Grey type thing, she let, what was his name? Christian. Christian no, and then Christian initiated, or he like, all right, let's go to that. Right, he, he made us on that contract. He said, I will not do nothing to you. Why don't you sign this contract? Cause he was into that joint. Yeah, but that comes with the dominant and submissive role. Everybody not dominant, so all girls not gonna feel comfortable with just like initiating it. But at the end of the day, like if you don't, I'm, I, I get what you're saying. But if you don't tell me no or yes, okay. So I tell you, yes, that's what I want. But I'm not automatically all over you and like ripping your clothes off when you, you don't got to. If you tell again, me, if but... you tell me, if you tell me you want the meat, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you, you know, I'm gonna get the, the, the messing with you. To get you riled up so you can be ready for it. What you mean? I'm confused. But all guys not like that. True. They're like, well, if you want it, then come get it. True. But it's like, I, <laughs> I want it, but I want you to come get it. Yeah. So, you feel like a guy should always initiate sex, right? Yeah. Okay. If they understand that their girlfriend or girl they having sex with right is really only submissive yeah but i gotta so why sh why can't both why can't a woman on my behalf it just feel awkward like it just feel awkward i feel like the dominant role is the male role but if you want some dick <laughs> now it's not gonna be like a hundred percent of the time, right? But more so, like eighty or eighty-five percent of the time. Eighty or eighty-five percent of the time, what? That he does it. Uh, he uh, initiate and tell you that he wants to do it. <laughs> like he don't gotta tell me. I can tell him, or like he can tell me, or, or whatever. But. He initiates it. <laughs> well, <coughs> I mean, hey, at the end of the day, pipe getting, pipe getting thrown at the end of the night. So, you know. Yeah, so at the end of the night, probably getting thrown at the night. You feel me? So. Right, but some people don't, they'll let it go on. Like, some dudes will let it go on. And be like, oh, she didn't initiate it, so she ain't gonna get it until she do. Hell no. That's weird to me. If I want to, you know? <laughs> You told me you want some, so I'm about to so get it. So now you about to get it. Yeah. But that's not, that's not everybody. Like, I've come yeah. in contact with the people that it's not everybody. Nah, I don't know. That's, that's weird. So at the end of the day. That's weird because why wouldn't you give if it to you her? If you know your girl want it, right? All right, why wouldn't you give it to her? It's beyond me. But it's people like that. True. It's everybody like that. They're like, so well, I didn't want to initiate it, so. Y'all, y'all let me know in the comments below who y'all should think initiate sex. The guy? The girl, or both, because we all grown. I feel like both. That's all I'm saying. Like, if you want something, come get it. If I want something, I'm come get it. You know what I mean? If I tell you anything, if she tell me, I tell her. That's just me. 
What age did you feel like a girl should initiate, a guy should always initiate it? Um, I don't think I had a specific age. Cause, okay, so. But you have to lose it by you before, going to get it. Before I got grown, I didn't necessarily initiate it. It will always be him to initiate it. And you would just be like. But that's the like typical teenage shit where the boy just come up and then, you know, start kissing you. And you're like, oh, so this is what you want. So I'm either about to say no. Or if he about to keep going. True. True. Right. So then we keep going. He initiated it. <coughs> well. Hey, this is the most I <coughs> Some water. What the fuck? I ain't coughed in so many years. I ain't gonna lie. I'm lucky, happy I'm coughing. As, as you didn't know, when you smoke it and you cough, you actually get higher. But that you do. That's weird. I ain't coughed <laughs> in you years. Blue. Well, I mean, I, I like didn't cough and damn near killed myself off the bomb, but awesome crud. He's talking about something damn near killed himself. I ain't have a cough off a blunt in a while. I ain't gonna lie. Mm. Y'all hit this. Yeah. No, y'all. Yeah, pass that bitch around. Yeah, <laughs> y'all niggas coughing too. This some shit. I'm telling you niggas, this some shit. <coughs> Off the plug. Yeah, for real. But. All right, so now. Huh. On the behalf of girls that like to be treated like Anna from 50 Cent. Wasn't that her name? I don't know. I just know his name was Christian Gray. <laughs> I think her name was Anna from 50 Shades Gray. That like to be treated like that. How do she? How would she even initiate that? Like just put her hair in his hands? I mean. Like. I, would. I, mean, you, I mean in my behalf you talk. That's what I do. I talk like, hey, you like this? You fuck with this? But I'm saying like, <clears throat> she already initiated at that very moment. Yeah. Right? Right. But she the type that be like to be thrown around and shit like that. And like, she ain't what know the that. Fuck she gonna do is throw right. herself around. She ain't know that, right? No, I mean after she knew that. After she knew. Oh, that. after she knew that. Well, yeah. she gotta tell me or like, or God just gonna do. It. At the end of the day, all guys are like not as freaky as Christian Gary, but as dominant. Like the the what is it the SNL the yeah. you know all of that guys a lot of guys do that you know choking hair pulling handcuffs paddle whip I don't know you know some guys out here be doing the whips and shit but you know a lot of guys into, and then a lot of girls be like yeah I'm with it. <coughs> I don't know in today's day and age it seems like everybody with the shits. Yeah. Everybody with the shits. The handcuffs to the bed. Being tied up with rope. Choking. Seem like everybody with the shits nowadays. That's all I'm saying. And it be like, but like when a girl initiated, it's gonna go far. Like, she would have to climb on top. Mm -hmm. So on and so forth. But if she the submissive type, her being on top not necessarily gonna turn her on. Her being roughed up is the part that turns her on. Right. Cause honestly, me, if I have to go into the dominant role more like fifty percent or more of the time, that shit's not gonna be for me. That's all gonna be for him. <clears throat> And that's only okay with girls that get satisfied by the man that they having sex with being satisfied. Baby girl not like that. She gonna be turned the fuck off until he do something to turn her on. True? I don't know. <laughs> I, ain't, I ain't never had this. 
You feel me? It's like, I mean, at the end of the day, if a girl do initiate that, you just get on top bar herself, which is rare. <laughs> which is rare. A girl just let me get on top. Shit, show me. <coughs> show me. Because, hell no. Show me. But, they don't already want it. Like, but, like, it be dudes that want that. True, yeah. yeah. yeah they, I mean, all guys want that. I ain't gonna lie. All and guys then, want that. And then, they will want it from a girl they know that don't like to do that shit. I mean, at the end of the day, it's like, they trying to get it from all guys' standpoint. Because... You know what I mean? I mean, all girls. I ain't even said that. Because, like, you'll be... You'll be fucking with Shantae, and then Shantae did that, and then you won't, you don't fuck with her no more. you like, shit, get on top of shit. Like, no, I'm straight. You're like, damn, you know? <laughs> it's like, it's just what he want in his sex life. And all girls not like that. That's all it is. And that could be the same thing for girls. Like I said... From the beginning until maybe about nineteen twenty, I never had to initiate it. True. Because, of course, a guy just going to get right into it. Or, like, my it's ex just... before he died literally always initiated it. But, <clears throat> he um, yeah. it can be like that for the girls. Because, like I said, up until, like, nineteen twenty, I never initiated it. No. Even when I was my ex who passed away, always initiated it. Always because he enjoyed that role, similar to how Christian enjoyed that role. Yeah. She never had to initiate it, or she could say I want it, and then he went into initiating it. Of course. But then it's like after that, I'll run into a guy that don't want to do that. I'll be like. All guys ain't the same. That's See, fine. but you just said that's how I'm hip. Don't be with Shantae, you know? Yeah, I'm hip. All guys ain't the same. So you just gotta. You just like. A bad sex life can't ruin a relationship. I ain't gonna lie. You, you, nigga, people can say I'm not in it for the sex, but if it's a bad sex life, the relationship ain't gonna last. That's just that's just a fact. So at the end of the day, you gonna try to. He gonna try to change you. Or you gonna try to change him, or y'all both gonna be trying to change each other, and it just ain't gonna work. Unless one of y'all fold. That's, that's, that's just the honesty. Nah. <clears throat> Shit. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of girls that look at it from my standpoint do got their breakdown days. Yeah. And the dude will wait on that. Enough is enough. Yeah. Like, all right, all right, all right. I got this shit now. <laughs> like, yeah. you're not making it through the door without me trying to rip your clothes off. But that's bold because it takes a minute to get to that stand point. True. True. So. Unless she like off the, off the crib, <laughs> off the lick. <laughs> Uh, yeah. She gonna get you give me Deuce a it. really bad. <laughs> Do say get you looser. <clears throat> so at the end of the day, you just feel like a guy should always initiate sex. Or at least understand. <clears throat> I would say understand whether the girl like like it or not. Right. Like I said. But at least communicate it. Cause then you know, she might be willing to change that shit around. True, true. Like I said, y'all let me know down in the comments below, and let me know in the comments what y'all want to see more on my channel. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it to your friends. All right, we out.